It's Happy Hours with Mark and Rachel. Howdy! Caught me in the middle of a drink. Oh, no. Welcome to Happy Hours with Mark and Rachel. That would be us. Hello. Happy Friday from the yes. Valley of the Sun. You found us again. We're so happy you're here. It was a uh, it was a cold, rainy day today. Yeah, you want to know why? Why? Donger came into town. Oh. She brought this shit with her. Okay. Mm. Thank well, you, Dong. I mean, the week was good. We had a My lot friend. of nice wet weather this week. and um, it, mm-hmm. but, but for some reason, the end of the week, all of a sudden the storm came in. And there we go. You said it came up so, from the Gulf, like Rocky Point. Oh, uh, it was just a big swirling uh, mass above our state, but it but it actually was pulling moisture in from um, like, down below, like us. down below. So us, not yeah. from the west, yeah. from um, California. Usually, yep. it like blows in, but this is yeah. from Rocky Point. Yeah. Thanks, Mexico. So, so anyway, we have a whole new um, kind of show to do today. Ugh. It's going to be uh, basically we have uh, taken out. We Mad branded Libs. a little bit, guys. Yes, we did. We took out the Mad change. Libs. We did some other things. And we have more topics to talk about. Like uh, Mark took the K off of my beer sign. I did. Now bye it's bye just K. beer. We're just the beer show. Uh, now, <laughs> now we have like the happy hours report. Uh, weird news. Yep, and we, just, we, we, we still have the Thirsty. And yeah. we still have Mystery Beer Theater. Yes, we do. And then we have something called Rachel Has Something to Say. I do because yeah. I always do. And so then, instead of Mad Libs, yeah. I guess we're just going to put a... Stop to that for a right. while because that and was getting a little drawn out, and we, it did. And I don't then, know if and, you guys and, liked yeah. it as much as we did. And so, what we're going to bring right. in is introduce in, is to some uh, in some video segments from what we did during the week, or um, yeah. like what we did today before the show. Oh yeah, okay, Are that's coming up. That? Yeah, I should share that probably uh, after we talk about. Let's do this first. Let's let's talk let's about. Keep going. Um, Just you tell me when you want to put our pregame. Well, what I'm saying is, let's talk about um, mm-hmm. our weekend, the the last weekend Ooh. that we were on here, mm-hmm. and we have some videos up for you guys to see if you want to see them on From last weekend. YouTube. That was so um, long ago, babe. And it's mm. and the site's called, uh, of course, for you, you listeners mm-hmm. out there, it's called Happy Hours with Mark and Rachel. Yeah, we kind of changed the yeah. name too. So. so we're still us. It's yeah. just a little different. But Why? but to see the videos, Why? that's where you have Il to go. Ha- happy hours, no India name at, w- with Mark and Rachel is what what, yeah. what is what it is. So go look that up. Um, I don't know how I, I I mean I can. Everybody watching doesn't need to see that. That's not that big of a deal. Yeah. But um, it's still us. It's still happy hour. You yeah. guys, whoever's joining, we appreciate you. Thank you mm-hmm. for liking and subscribing. Mm-hmm. Have mm-hmm. your beer of choice or libation of choice while you're watching us right and listening. So so thanks. We went to out of Africa. With we the did. kids on Saturday, yeah. which yep. was really fun. It was a gift. My my parents gave us a bunch of tickets for the family, so we incorporated that gift into right. this last week because uh-huh. it was, you know. And then after that. Perfect weather to go. Rachel and I went up to Day's Hotel. So mm-hmm. we, there's videos up on, on YouTube to watch if you guys are listening and you want to yeah, go yeah. see them. There's, there's the Out of Africa. We are And there's also sometimes. Day's Hotel, which was, a, which was a fun Fun time because we we actually went there to um, mm-hmm. basically to go party. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it was. We just it was didn't like, want to go home party. yet. Yeah. We weren't done. We ain't yeah. done. Nope. So we left out of Africa after we had a nice time with the family. We had a little birthday party with Sparrow. She mm-hmm. turned eight. Our granddaughter. Our only granddaughter. Mm-hmm. We love you dearly. We made cupcakes and. Gave her her capybaras okay, so, that she wanted, and what did second. she say? This is so stupid because <laughs> no. we were doing it out in the parking lot, yeah. in the back of our truck. Okay. that's what we do. All right, so here's the thing: you say our only <laughs> grand, our only granddaughter. But, but that, that's just the granddaughter. We have three grand. I did. I said she's our only granddaughter. Yeah, three grandsons. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's extra special. Yeah. Um, right about here somewhere, I'm going to put in a um, video of a sample, <laughs> uh, mm-hmm. the sample of what we did before the the show started, and it's. Mm-hmm. A sample video uh, we did. I we tried out my cider and my ale that I made. Uh, the ale I made about uh, what was it? 
about a month and a half ago or something like that. Okay, I have a question. Then, We're not going to talk over it, though, because no, 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 no. voice is in it. So I'm gonna put how it are you going to do that? Uh, well, as soon as we finish talking here. Um, basically, I, I put, uh, I, I did a okay. cider, and then I did, um, mm-hmm. well, first of all, I did the ale. Mm-hmm. I made the ale. I made some, okay, let's just get into detail about this real quick, <laughs> okay. okay? And how Last, long was it? Did you check? Okay. How long do we have to sit here and be quiet while it's running? You don't have to <laughs> sit and be quiet okay. at all. <laughs> Just checking. It's called editing, honey. Oh, okay. Uh, I just uh-huh. wanted to make sure I wasn't supposed to talk no. or something. Oh, no, no, you can do whatever. No, no, um, no, no, no. Listen. So what? What? What was? <laughs> what happened was this. Uh, I started brewing ciders a couple years ago, yeah. and I bought all these cider jug kits. You did. And, They've been in here. Um, in there. They oh. all pretty much sucked. They they weren't Why the best ciders. Well, they weren't the best ciders in the world. I tried to copy my brother's uh, mead. Like- so good and that itself. was not good either. I mean, the the, the meat I made was awesome. tasted, I don't know, it sat for a year and it just, mm-hmm. I don't know. I guess you don't, you're not supposed to let it sit in the bottles in the closet for a year. Well, I, what were you I, supposed I to know. do? Put them in the fridge? I don't They're know. not open. It just didn't taste what real What do warehouses do on their, when their beer is in storage out in the they garage? Get it, they get it out there as quick as possible. Um, they, have an, they have a date on in any cans and anything true. else. Like, do they you have, have a date, date on yours? No. Uh, no, my, my the dates are... Uh, Worn out. That's <laughs> they're past that. So it those fermented. You'll see when you watch the video. Well, no, that, no, that, those aren't that old. I, I, I put those in the in the closet to age a bit. It was in fine. the dark. I actually drank them all. Um, the mm-hmm. L I did probably about mm-hmm. a month or so ago. Oh, the L. Yeah. Oh yes. And I only have we did that on. A I only have show. two of those left, and and Sorry. one of them is they were good. that we drank, mm-hmm. and then the next one is. In the fridge still, so we have that. Okay. Uh, the cider, though, the cider, the cider. I did That's about. What I like better. I, I no, I said a, a month on the on the ale. It was probably been two months, three months, maybe. Yeah, it was probably a month on the cider. Yeah, the right? cider. Yeah, That's the cider was at least. I'd have to go back month, and look yeah. at our footage to see. And it's getting a little bit better. That. It's clarifying it in the bottle. It's, mm-hmm. it's doing better. Yeah, I do have a one more thing before I show you the video. Oh, here, okay. here. Ho, did I say ho? Ho, ho, ho. ho. Um, who are you calling I'm a call ho? ho. ho. Um, what I, I'm hoochie. That's what I'm called at work, <laughs> actually. So the the not other thing ashamed. is this. Uh, she's not ashamed at all. Mm. The other thing is this. I did a, mm. a beer. What did you do? A, when did I do it? Uh, last Thursday. It's there's a video up of no there's not a video up I don't I don't have it finished yet uh-huh. so Who's until I bought until I just listen kidding. until just I kidding. bottle it you've been working really hard at doing some changes so I appreciate that no listen until mm-hmm. I bottle mm-hmm. oh my gosh sorry I until I bottle that yeah. um it's, it's it's sitting down here in the corner just, it was Blowing. bubbling away this week it kind of calmed down and then it has to sit and then okay. and then do its thing so I know I bring that up probably like almost every probably show probably all the time I do. But anyway, right? here here okay. is the clip for you that we did right before we started the show. Pre-gaming. Hey Rachel, what? Come in. Oh, you're right there. Uh, I got I got something for you to try. I mean, all right. I know we've tried this before, right? Oh, geez, hi. Yeah. Good to see you there. Uh, we've we tried this before. This is uh, well, this is my ale. I did this white house ale about a month and a half ago or so. And it's been in the fridge for a long time. Let's see. Okay. Did we tried this already? Yeah. But it's been sitting and aging. And it smells okay. really good now. Um, now that you like those. Okay. So I wanted to try. This is before. By the way, this is before the show because we want to. Oh, yeah, we're free gaming. We have free gaming. We've got. We yeah. We're not even doing that Ooh. yet. Wow. Look it's very that. golden for our listeners. Yeah. It's golden. And, and it's it not has, very foamy. It has this a nice head on it. for me. Let's smell right. it. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Smells like beer. It smells good. Looks like a nice uh, amber. Ah, it's got some nice, hues. nice bubbles coming up in there. This isn't the uh, cider, right? No, this is the this is the ale I made. Well, it's a little fermenty. But it's still good. It's not bad. It's not bad. It actually turned out pretty clear. Um, I got another beer coming yeah. too. Okay, I'll, I'll um, drink this. Um, what are we? What ooh, it's strong. We over there. I got some more shit. Hang on. Mm. Yeah, I would not order this at a bar. I'm sorry, because I'd be sitting there with this face the whole time. It you know little, what? It tastes, tastes a little. It tastes a little smoky. Fermented. I don't, I like like um, fermented. No, I, the taste, I taste a smoky flavor, like um, 
like like uh, someone was barbecuing with it. Maybe you this were is, when you were making it. Uh -uh. And this is my apple cider that I did. Um, it's, okay, this oh, does it's, clear, look like it's clarified it's, a lot it's though. Clarified a little bit mm -hmm. compared to how much it was before. Yeah, and it's apple it does. Cider. It still doesn't have any bubbles. All though. right. Oh well, it's, it's fizzing. It does. Yeah. I see a lot of fizz in this. So it's, ooh, it um, smells good. I smell the. Ooh, the, it's very appley. I smell the cinnamon and clove. Uh huh. And, let me taste it. All right, let's see. See if see if it's getting better. I still have a couple more mm. of these. Yeah, I like this much better. Mm, it's got a fizz to it. Mm -hmm. mm. This is much better than the other one, honey. You like this one? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm getting better as I do this. Yeah. Um, I do have I a wonder, beer in there right now that has to sit for another week, and then I'm going to bottle it, and then have to sit for another week. I would almost buy this at a bar. Almost, yeah. Almost. But not bad, huh? I was really drunk, man. <laughs> well, I think if I put more sugar in it, it would have been better. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, everybody, back to the show. Right, and nice. now... Let's do something that we always do on this show that we love so much, oh, so I much, very, very, so very much. Let's do this. Oh, geez, that's loud. Turn it down. Yeah, that's so much. Oh, you know why? Wait, what, why? what happened, babe? I had so much bass on that. That's okay. It's happy hour. Just a little shit bassy. happens. Uh, yeah, it sure does. You guys know shit happens. Uh, you're it okay happens. with it. That's it why you're here. It happens on happy hour, and that's Ooh, how Mark it is. made some fresh um, what is I did. It? orange juice. Yeah. I'm shaking it up. Okay, so this is going to be an interesting one, and, and Rachel likes interesting drinks here. So I do. It's going to be this. Oh, they're fermented in the closet. Oh, I'm not I'm so gonna... fond of those. <laughs> yeah. That's okay. Well, look, they're I'll really, try anything. They're once. really not that bad. I'm I'm serious. They're not that bad. They're good drinks. Baby, it's okay. You're much better than you were the last time you tried to make stuff. It's good. I get better as I age. Yeah, like a fine wine, sweet. Fine wine. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna open it. That's I got good, it. Right oh, good. I got that. My hands are dry. That's why. You're okay. Open. That for you. <gasps> what and is this? I, I open it for me. Glasses, babe. You're okay, so what this me? is is a, a Vale bot Botanic Collection. Um, vale Botanic Collection. It's oh, infused yeah. with natural grapefruit and rose okay, flavors. Okay, we've done this in my little uh, recipe book I'm going through. Mm -hmm. We've tried this before. I don't remember if we tried it with this or something else, but uh, we're, we're we're doing something a little different on this one. We're just doing because I, um, I am port. So these are uh, what do you call it? Ninety uh, nines. Yeah, it's 80 proof. It says 30. No, is it 80? 60. Is it 60 or 80? Mm, I can't read that. It is a, a good can question. See? I can, but um, it's a, Let me look. I'll look here. It's I'm really pouring small. it. I'm going to say it says 60, but it could say 80. Yeah. It's 30%. 30% alcohol. So it's probably... It's 50 ml, oh. so... Well, Someone anyways. else has been wearing these damn things. It's 60 proof. 60. Wow. See, I just need these. And I can tell Rachel had them on before because they're no. smeared and smudged. Babe, babe no, these what? are mine. Look how bad these are. No, look. What? Those are mine. I know, and these are like that too, so these it can't are be. These worse. Can't be. <laughs> no. These are over You here. must have had your hands on these for a bit. I, I did not. I okay. promise. So, I'm going to use my double in the shirt. <laughs> you can see it's St. Patty's Day weekend. I'm rocking So it. those were the Veil Botanicals. Clean I'm cleaning them. Yeah. With my um, okay. shirt and, and my glasses. And we're going to put about... It didn't help too much. Bit. Probably three ounces of fresh squeezed orange juice in this botanical. Yeah, we're gonna okay? go to a bar tomorrow. Or what? We are going to go to a place called. Uh, what is it called? Uh, I, just I forgot. Yard, yard, yard house. Are we house. gonna go do a video at the yard house? Yeah. Are we gonna get kicked out of the yard house? I don't know. I we we'll probably not. won't be there that long because I have to you drive. have to drive. But it's in Why a place where I can walk her around. Because I like to drive. Because um, I don't. Babe, but it's in nicer. a place where we can walk around. We can. Just get the mall thing and stuff. We can go over to Dave and Buster's Susan, and throw that away? Thank you. do stuff too if you want. Um, it's up to you. Okay, look, that's pretty. Uh, it's floating at the bottom. Now, can you stir that with a straw? Uh, if I have to do yeah. everything. I don't know if this is going to taste good or not, but we're going to find out. All right. That fresh orange juice might mask the flavor of rose. You got these from where? Where'd you get the orange juice? One of my customers, uh, she gave it to me. Is her day. name Rose? Like, no, mm, but she I'm goes, wondering. "You want some oranges?" And I said, "Yeah, sure." Her name is. I mean, now why not? Rose. I mean, I'll I'll, I'll take 
freaking oranges. And I came home and I had two bags and I squeezed them all and mm. did this. So this now, is a botanical. It's a botanical blend. Fruit rose thingamajig. Right. So it is this. Let's let's say this. Okay. It's uh, what is it? It's I haven't tasted it's a it yet. Grapefruit it's... rose, veil, botanical blend with Gra- orange juice. Grafruity, and Grafruity Rose. Zero sugar. And I'm mm-hmm. going to let you name it because you always want to name it anyway. So, Well, you do name a lot of them, but sometimes mm-hmm. I have to make shit up. Um, I just taste orange juice. I don't even taste the... I don't even taste the, the I feel rose like we or, said this last time. We just called it just orange juice. I think that's well, I don't know. I, I mean, I, I don't think we did it with orange juice. We probably did it with something else. Yeah, maybe. Or, we're not oh, really we might have did it with grapefruit juice. I don't know. If I mean, look. maybe slightly I, I get a... I in my neck. If, if I look like I'm... Um, like a, like Stiff, I am. Okay. Um, um, I, I was gonna say maybe if I if I if I think about it, I get mm-hmm. a little hint of the a floral rose. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not bad though. It actually mis- mm-hmm. mixes with the orange juice and makes it. Taste- oh, I think I called it like Golden Girl or something because it had rose in it. I think mm. I don't know. I had to look back. That was a long time ago. Yeah. Um, this is really yummy. Let's it's just good. think of something new. Do you like? I don't um, even taste uh, um, vodka in it at all. Nope. How about we call it, where's the vodka? Where's the vodka? Where's the vodka? Where'd it go? go. Where'd it go? It's a secret. How, do you want to call it that? Where'd the vodka go? Sure. Oh, that's the name of we this one. We can do whatever Change you want. Approved. Where'd the vodka go? The weird go thing is, I, 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 don't know, I don't know if you've been noticing this, Rachel, but what? around the house, there's these... <sighs> I'm so sorry. No, there's these Nazi. like little gnats. and they're, I mean, this year. I mean, friend. where are they coming from? They're like all over the place. I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's because I had like maybe it's because I had all that orange fruit sitting around. I think so yeah, and we have plants that yeah. get little gnats. And oh, mm-hmm. I saw our first mosquito in the house today. Oh, From no. I saw it. It was in over by the dishes. I have these little things little um, in the plug outlets them. that you can buy on Amazon. By the way, plug Amazon. Hey. Okay, here we go. I, I, I write that down. Amazon plug. Amazon. Yeah, we're plug. affiliates for that now. Yeah. So um, go buy so, that shit. So they're they're they're. I, Do they I gotta, still work? I'll put them. Oh yeah, they're still okay. working, and they actually work. They're like the little bug zappers that you put in your. That'd be a good uh, thing to put on our, our uh, Pinterest thingies yeah. because yeah, I, I will, and I'll now put it on here too. Now is the time because it's they're uh, coming out. Mosquitoes are coming out. Zappers. People and in are the gonna house? be wondering. They're gonna be searching the the internet looking for bug zappers. And guess who yeah. has them? We do. Well, you you get them in. You can buy them in a pack, and they have a little like ultraviolet uh, <laughs> lights in them. Which kid always turned them off? Uh, it's Lincoln because what happened was <laughs> one time Lincoln <laughs> oh. zapped his finger. He stuck his finger through there. So every oh, time he comes over, that's why he turns them off. Every time he comes over, he turns it off. Oh, what a it's like, oh, it's like, dude, cute. what the, what the hell? So he put if his he, finger in it and it listen, hurt and he's like, oh, this ain't happening. Turn it off. Well, he cried. And then I, and, oh. but then I said to him, look, it's keeping mosquitoes away. But in my mind, I'm thinking, our, it's our dude, fault for having something that can no, electrocute a child at that level. I didn't just think about it. It was your, just a little keep light. Keep your little freaking fingers out of it. That's all. The kids like to put fingers in things. I didn't think no. about that actually. They but now do. they're all older. And like and their nose. Griffin stuff like that. knows better. Okay. He's been over there. By the way, there's I'll a new, there's a, here's one of the new additives that I'm doing to mm. the show. Uh, I don't have a sound effect for this yet, and I will oh, do what? it. It's called the Happy Hours Report, and it has a couple of oh. different in, instra, interesting items that we're going to do. So, okay. first of all, I'm going to do something called uh it, it's just the happy hours report you guys are gonna get and so much new information i don't even know what we're gonna get so what, what i'm gonna like do it. on this part usually is mm-hmm. is I'll, I'll put some kind of a background in here so we can hear it but i'm gonna start with this this is interesting okay, okay. uh this is these are just weird facts or something. Mm, I, I guess they're weird, weird stories you weird read? facts there i have a weird news story that's even okay that this Let me is have bizarre it. everybody but, get your beer let's listen to mark so okay. this one is a simple one. Mm. It's just well, I don't know. Simple. Okay, but uh, we saw a sloth last weekend at the. We uh, did. He was cute. At the Get out of Africa. Butt. So, I'm I'm going to say that sloths can hold their breath longer than dolphins. Do you know that? How long can dolphins hold their breath? I said well, that's what I, I want to okay, know they, now. This, okay, here you go. Uh, dolphins need to come up for air every ten minutes, hmm. but by slowing Not their the heart rate. Sloths can actually hold their breath for up to 40 minutes. Now, the thing is, though. Why would they want to do that? The thing is, though, can a sloth <laughs> hold his breath underwater for 40 minutes? <laughs> Why would anybody dunk a sloth? I don't know. They would be drowning the poor baby. I know, but maybe it could stay alive underwater and the dolphin could come and get it and rescue it and bring it to the surface. I saw a squirrel run across the street when I was driving down like a huge street the other day. Mm-hmm. 
It's like a fast sloth. I don't know. It just no, it's not I just, a sloth. I don't not know why close. I brought that up, but All it right. reminded me of that. Here's another one. <laughs> just did. Are you ready for this one? Yeah. Did you know that a shrimp's heart is in its head? Did uh, you know that? I, a shrimp's that heart I is in heard, its head. I thought yep. I might have heard that. Well, I'll tell you what. Do, do lobsters, and, uh, do they do, is that two? Do they all have it that way? I, well, is that why they I suck mean, the brain? I, 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 would, I would assume suck that the because the they're kind of like the same. That's why when you suck the, the, the suck back of the head of the whatever, the crayfish or whatever, mm. you get all that yummy Green goodness. goop. No, I don't it's do good. that. Yuck. According babe. to uh, yeah, Tele- Telenga today, mm. which, I don't know what that is, but. Shrimp have their hearts the along with their vital organs, such as their stomach and, and, virtual, and, and ventral nerve cord mm-hmm. inside their heads due to the safety that is part of the body that provides over the tail end. Okay, so if you've ever prepared a head on shrimp, then uh, you'll know that the head and thorax are the thickest and hardest parts of the body. This section, known as the cephalic portion, cephalic. covered cephalic. I cut that shit uh, off. Covered with a thick protective substance. Uh, I mean, you could suck the brain if you want to. Known as That's the gross. exoskeleton. The exoskeleton is, uh, guards the shrimp's internal organs oh, against... Gross, heart- oh, yeah. You know, it's true. It's mm-hmm. like when you pop the head off and you yeah, got the I'm body just, part and you got all that stuff in the it, back yeah. there that you could just like oh that's why you debane them and get all the crap that's the poop track the brain though you don't suck yeah. the poop track just the brain no I just love the shrimp that's really only the, the, yeah. the seafood that I like the best it's just the brains yuck but I don't suck the brains okay, okay what else you now, got babe now I've got weird news here oh like that wasn't weird enough okay what else you got no this is weird news mm-hmm. Um, th- I'm calling so this one. I'm babe. calling this one. <laughs> is it? it? Well, I don't know. I'm just right. drinking, listening. This is what right. happy hour I'm, is. You I'm, sit around, you BS with your. Oh with no your buds. wonder my headphone crap is messed up. Hang on. Uh oh. Here, that's your headphones. Oh. I'm like going. This is not right. I He's got, been wearing mine. Ah. I don't want to wear mine. It, fluffs, it uh, squishes my hair. Yeah. Okay. Well, mine's okay. That's no, fine. Not that you guys care, but weird. I don't like feeling it. Weird my news, weird news. Stuff. I mean, I was like, why am I using like those? Sensory, I don't, I don't like know. It. Anyway, uh, uh, we're just going to call this one Weekend of Bernie's. It's going to be a weird one. Funny movie from the 80s. Lo- Very funny. Loreen Bea Forello, 55 years old. And mm-hmm. this was this happened on March March 4th. Of uh, this okay, year? Of this year, yeah. Okay. And Karen Kasbaum, 63, Rock. They were. Uh, okay. She was charged with. Uh, they were charged with uh, theft and gross abuse of a corpse after allegedly carrying out what? weekend at Bernie's stunt in Ashtabula, oh Ohio. God. The smoking, Ohio was doing yeah, this. The smoking gun. Oh no. Okay, Bummer. sorry. I'm gonna say that. On, Your peeps uh, are weird. Anyway, so on March fourth, police said Farello and Ka- Cass Bomb, mm-hmm. who <laughs> who were not related to. Each other. A guy named Douglas oh. Layman, he was 80 years old, dead man. but lived in his home, uh, yeah, dead man, <laughs> loaded his corpse into the front seat of a car oh, in such seat. a manner that he could be vis- visible to the bank staff and drove through a, his bank where they used his car to withdraw $900. Oh. The bank had allowed the women to withdraw from his account before as long as he was with them. Having secured the funds, the women then dropped Layman's body at the Astabula County Medical Center emergency room <laughs> without providing any information about the man or themselves. Oh my God. So they he, dumped him he at died. It's like, hey, let's use him one more time. <laughs> hey, you know what? I got a good idea. Okay, Let's that- go down and get some money before uh, we dump his body. This, yeah, yeah. this brings uh, up an interesting yeah. point. Um, your shit is strong, <laughs> babe. Um, I know. When I'm driving... Uh-huh. And I'm taking you through the bank, and you're depositing stuff, <laughs> and I give it to the people, and they're like, hi, um, you're not Mark. I'm like, no, we're depositing. <laughs> Is Mark with you? I'm like, does it really f- matter? I'm you like, could do yeah. the weekend bursting. I can make me wave, have a string. <laughs> but why do they care? I'm putting something yep, in. I'm not go. taking it out. So I know. weekend at Boynies. Boynies. Have it been better. So anyway, That's the rest funny. of the story is this. <laughs> That's <laughs> okay, why they though. do that. Anyway. <laughs> um, Interesting. Okay, let's see uh, what what it says. Uh, the emergency. Okay, without trying. Okay, uh, they were able to identify the women and question them. The women, both ha- who have had sick, significant priors, said mm-hmm. Lehman died at home. Oh, him? Oh, I don't uh, know him. So he died, and then they then they concocted this weird idea. <laughs> oh, hey, this just throw him in the car. <laughs> and that was Ohio, not Florida, or something. It was that was Ohio. Ohio. Yeah. 
right. So, interesting. Big Bill was really interesting. A lot of things happened in Ohio, but that was pretty weird. Yeah, I don't think I would have the guts to try to pull that off. However, I'm going to try. Okay, do we have string? Because next, <laughs> next time, time we go time through, I I'm, I'm going like, to pull it and make you go like this. And just make see if Mark they... the puppet no, in the I'm car. Just, pretend like you're yeah. dead or asleep or something, and I'll just pull your arm and go like this, and let's see if they're watching. All right. Let's try it. You know, you know, this is my favorite time in the show. Um, mm. Wow, we started a lot of uh, beers before this, but my okay. favorite time in the show is this, Come and on, it's wait. Mr. Beer Theater. <laughs> Watch your hands, babe. Ice chest. There it is. I got it. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. This is my favorite. This is my favorite time because I love this? sampling uh, beers. Excuse and me? by the way, when Nathan oh, uh, allowed us to, come on. was that last week we sampled? No, that was that was a couple weeks ago. I think we sampled what? his his delicious. That was a few beer. weeks ago. Um, that was good. While. Yeah, it was really good. So anyway, anyway, what you got? let's go. Here we go, Mister Beer. Mr. Beer Theater. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, wow. Half okay. Of the time, I just pick them because they're pretty. I have no idea. So if I make a face like this, because I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just, just going like to say. the pretty can. I know, but I'm, I'm going to say this. Um, the thing is, I think you're going to like this one. Because, Yay. Well, not like this one. Mm-hmm. Um, probably not. I'm going to like this one. <laughs> you're like, you're I think going I'm, to, you were talking about yourself again, I know. weren't you? I was, so I'm going to, I'm going to definitely like this one. Here we go. Why? Because I like the smell of it already. Mm, maybe I it's. I can't smell it yet. Maybe it's not. Oh, it's bad. so pretty though. Well, it's Ooh, very clear. It is the clearest. This looks like a pilsner, like clear. This looks like a we'll natty see. light. Are you giving me a natural light, baby? Oh no. Okay. No. Are you sure it looks. Well, not from good. the smell. Oh no. Uh, I'll tell you, it has. Well, I, should I mean, plug it does. My nose it, right no, now. no, I don't think so. I, it's very drink clear. It smelling it. Uh, it might be a West Coast IPA because they can be clear, I guess. Uh, let's put that there. Okay, let's. Uh, oh, okay. Here we go. Is it blocking you? No. Oh, well, I was just trying to turn it so I can't see it. I, I like the smell it's of it. It's got the wiggles on the top. I do, I do completely smell. And, Is that and the Arizona? Is that a, it has a mm, nice... It has a nice... China something? Okay, let me just... It has smell. a nice... Oh, um, geez. Why did I smell that? No, it's very clear, and and the and there's a nice head of foam on it, and there's like nice bubbles coming up, and it smells like so, new carpet. It does not. Everybody <laughs> That's what I got that it. likes IPAs uh, would new probably carpet smell is good. Let's see, here if we you're go. Not drinking it, I said. Let's see. Okay, that's it. Mm. Oh, it's refreshing. Mm. It's cool. That's interesting. It is interesting. And it still has that IPA flavor, that the hop flavor. Oh, what am I? Am I tasting mm. popcorn? Oh, that weird! Yeah, that's weird. The ending part, huh? It, it did have, a, and it's not popcorn. It can't be popcorn. It's popcorn in my mouth, I said. I mean, because I still taste the bitter hop um, notes on there. It started with the bitter, but it ends with popcorn. I don't even. I don't know. know. Corn, I didn't taste popcorn, cor- but I mean, I did. I movies. did get some. I did get something in there. Yeah, like you said. I know. I got it. Um, mystery mm. beer. Okay, well, as far as it goes, it's so pretty. It looks like a normal classic beer. You For- take a picture and put it in a commercial. It's beautiful. <clears throat> But it, but it, I mean, I taste the hops, and I would say this, right? Okay, listen. The hops went away right fast. I don't. They I, do, but you still have I'm a little bit. Not li- not liking this. Not not so, liking this. Yeah, I'm not I, not liking this. I uh, like it. And I little said. little bitter notes at the end. Let's see what it they is. They went what away. I got popcorn in my mouth. I taste popcorn. <laughs> is it called popcorn? Um, it's in my made mouth? by Maui Brewing Company. Mm, popcorn. The, it's a lager. What the hell? The, the Hawaii life. Four point two percent alcohol. That's why am I getting hops so much? Swim, uh, epic swim, mm-hmm. Maui. Why am I getting uh, crafted with uh, passion? Uh, passion inspired by paradise. We are mm. an innovative and independent brewery. Welcome to the jungle, Ohana, Ohana? Ohio. <laughs> Welcome to Ohio, <laughs> uh, Maui Brewing Company, Mau- MauiBrewing dot com. Mm. I I swear I tasted hops. Mm. Why is it hoppy? I, 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 folk. Oh, there it is. It's a uh, Citra and Mos. Mo- Don't know. Mo- what is that? I got get my blurry glasses over here. Sorry, guys. Uh, to see what the. <laughs> I uh, F, that's about, I don't know. I don't know. Um, but I taste popcorn. Mosaic. I feel like I'm at oh, the okay. movies and I like it. Citra and Mosaic hop, hopped lager. Okay. Uh, very good. That's a very good one. That's wow. Not bad. I could chug this and not be mad. Yeah. 
had it. But it has 110 100. calories, so that's not go. too bad. That's not bad. No, um, we can do lighter ones sometimes. But wow. if you're watching your calories, okay. Well, I like it. 110. Well, you know, we have the light beers that are mm-hmm. like 90 or whatever, 95. What's I drank that in like 15. I drank that in like five seconds. That's not a bad beer. Fucking Save hey, the good. can. Save the can. I might okay, make wait, another I'm gonna chug it. mosaic thingy somewhere. Mosaic oh, thingy. And it says and it says mosaic on the can. So there you go. Wow. Okay. I have to say mm. I like that. I could chug it. We have to get more of this. Oh, I know it's not bad. Uh, that w- that came from the uh, Hawaii Life. D A. Duh. 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 The Hawaii okay. Life. Light lager. It's light. 4.2 AB. AB. Yeah. ABC. I just said all that. So anyway, here's the thing. We we I did the happy hours report, which I yeah. have to make a audio for. Yeah. Uh, now the audio ha- oh. has to do with Rachel has something to say. I do. Rachel we has something to say. probably make some kind of intro like. Yeah. <gasps> She does? I'm or, not going to listen. I don't know. Something I do, like that. Uh, Boo. Snoring. Maybe. I could do this one. Rachel has something to say. Huh? I remember that. What? What the hell is she what talking about? Yeah, but, but it's, about? this is interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't even so know what I was doing She's my homework. Right mm. Is that done something yet? Give it a second. Well, it's almost over. We have to make a new intro. No. Well, I know. I'll make a new intro when this one's finished. Tell me when to talk then. Okay, because you don't have your headphones on. So you can't talk. Okay, go ahead, babe. Thanks. Okay, so I saw something this the other day. This show's a disaster. It is not. I you said. always say that every time I'm talking. What's, do I need <laughs> no, no, to be offended no, or what? No, no, no. Disaster of uh, not... Me. Well, I mean, look. This is the first new episode of Happy Hours. Things are not always going to go as planned. Just get over that. Okay. However, we are on schedule, aren't we? Okay. Sure. Anyways, I'm, I saw something the other day, and I was interested because it said... The zodiac signs and the cocktails that are best oh. suited for you. Mm. And I'm like, hmm, what do you want? What do you think I'm going to like to drink? So, and it had to do with like er, the herbs. Like they're like mm-hmm. making earth signs, star signs, like anything. So anyway, so I pulled myself up, which I am Sagittarius. And <laughs> the, the, okay, I'm just going to tell, I'm just going to tell you what it is. I don't know if we're going to ever try to make it, but maybe we will. It's called the Sage Lady. I think we need to make all the drinks that you're going to talk so, about here. Cause. But the problem is that I don't like chunks. I don't like muddled stuff. And most of these are muddled. This one has sage in it. So you mix a little cucumber, a bit of sage, and mango vodka. Mm-hmm. I can see the mango and cucumber because I love cucumbers. But the floaties of the sage, I don't know. Anyways, Sage is the inspiration for this, and it should appeal to um, my adventurous side, is what it said. Anyways, it said it's um, also very difficult to describe because the combos are sage unique. and ma- sage and mango. Yeah. They said you can maybe you've eaten a mango with cucumbers, or mm-hmm. maybe you've enjoyed cum- cucumbers well, with you get sage. The, but they're you, putting these together, and it's very interesting. Can you drink get, is what they said? I mean, that's what I'm saying. Can you get the um, mango? Is there a vodka with sage and mango in it? No, there's a vodka with mango, and then you have to get cucumber, probably cucumber water, I and you then said you muddle sage. I thought sage. you said sage. It is, and you muddle sage with it. I don't know. Oh, it has a little cucumber, and too. And then okay. the three come together, and it's an extremely new experience. All right. So I don't know if I'm going to like that. I, I think we should try it, though. Cucumber, I mean, sage, and mango vodka. I don't I'm know. up for anything. Anyways, that's the Sagittarius sage lady. And that was yours. So then I pulled up... Oh, the next in line was Taurus, which is actually our daughter. Uh huh. Which I one? I pulled uh, Savannah. Okay. Savannah, are you listening? Is this thing on? Um, old time <laughs> oh, yeah. sour. So you are time, my dear, is what the uh, herbs stars are aligning. Okay. So it, this the is herbs what, are telling you. This is what it said. It said, rarely does Irish whiskey, mm, whiskey, uh, receive the <laughs> treatment it does in Wait the old stuff. Time sour. Doesn't she like bourbon or something? Prob- she probably will like this. That's why I'm reading yeah. it. It's unique and intriguing and a cocktail you'll come to rely on over time. We'll see. Mm. Um, okay. Taurus connection to the earth Ooh. is thyme, which is mixed with cinnamon. Cinnamon. I love thyme. To create a custom Chime. syrup. So you want to make a cinnamon syrup? I don't, I, I don't it's know. It's a lot of work. It is. You, stay with me. Um, okay. okay, you make a custom syrup. She's going to say no. This There's too much work. This accents the herbal liqueurs of a St. Germain and a Chartreuse. Those are two things I've never tried. Anyways, while what? it requires a bit of patience, we know you are perfect <laughs> for the job, is what it said. 
Okay. You already said that's too much work. <laughs> no. Who's not patient, babe? Uh, me. I'm yeah. a Virgo. I am not patient for shit. And that's how it goes. Oh, okay. Let's Virgo. Go oh, I had the paper backwards. I read the back before I did the first. Because okay. I did you first. But anyways, um, what I said was, what's your sign? Well, there's a drink for that. <laughs> oh, God. I should have started um, with that. Okay. Anyways, um, so Virgo, you that's are a mine. whiskey smash. Oh. Whiskey smash. I'm smashed a lot, but um, I don't know about whiskey. No frills, no fluff. It's clean. It's practical. <laughs> and can use bourbon. You don't have to use whiskey. You can use bourbon, they said. Too. I can use whatever I want. Similar to an old fashioned. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Like yeah. dear old dad used to A make. dear old dad used yeah, to make. Similar to the old fashioned. The Virgo spin comes from <laughs> mint. Mint. Which mint. is um, muddled along with fresh lemon. Top okay. with whiskey and syrup. And enjoy. I don't like uh, that syrup thing. What do you keep doing with syrup? I'm not a big fan you of that. You don't like don't it. Think. Yeah. And um, but it's fun to discover all the things that are associated with your ast- uh, astrological signs, is what it says. So, okay. um, and then the last one was a uh, Shaylee who doesn't listen, so I didn't like write everything down Whatever, for Shay. her. But hers sounded the yummiest. Mm-hmm. Um, hers is called Gemini. It's the daiquiris. Daiquiris is uh-huh. how they said it. Beautiful cocktail that includes <laughs> honey and lavender and blueberry shrub. Oh, I love blueberries. Perfect contrast. Oh. You know to me and blueberries. Rum and water, sparkling water. So you know me rum, and blueberries. Sparkling water, mm-hmm. some blueberry shrub. But where are you going to get a blueberry shrub? You have to grow it and then pull the leaves and uh, muddle that? I don't yeah, like muddling I mean, anything. It's very hard to bl- grow blueberries here in Arizona because of the, uh, the we don't have the acidic soil. And then honey that, and you know, lavender, where do you get that? I don't, I don't, I don't know. That know. Honey and lavender Is store, it lavender probably. extract? It didn't say because get, I didn't expand enough to see it because she doesn't listen. I so don't I know. didn't like open a big page. Anyways, Are you it did done? sound the best. Okay, that's good, baby. Anyways. You did you did good. I like that. Savannah, and that's you are thyme. Mark, you are mint. And I am sage. I am just Shaley's bourbon, lavender. it sounds like to me. So. Yeah, Shaley's lavender. But and anyways. Anyway, so that's a new feature in the that's show. That's why she works at Rachel the has something to say. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, there you go, so, guys. I thought that was interesting. Yes. And guess what's coming up this weekend? Uh, more interesting Patrick's, stuff. Patty's Day. Yes, see my shirt. On Sunday. Yeah, we're both wearing shirt. our uh, <gasps> dub, dub shirts. You? Yes, we're wearing you dub shirts. Oh, yeah. well, no, that's Lucy. Lucy, you were uh, I was holding her. You'll see that little clip in there, too. Yeah. Uh, all over the place. And anyway, so. I do not want to try those drinks because there's too much muddling involved. Sorry. Do you know what the Do you know what the what? green means? Mm-hmm. Um, do you know what the green means? And for for you know, if you're wearing, you have to wear green. Green means jealousy. Well, no, no, no. On St. Patrick's Day, you have to wear green, and, and you say you get, um, you get pinched or whatever. If you yeah, don't, yeah, your luck, luck of the Irish. It's um, a lucky color. My eyes are green, so I'm lucky. I've never you had are. to wear green and, and I, all the and time. And I and I work out in yards a lot, I so pinched. I have green on my pants or shoes well, I mean, or I used whatever. To get so I, 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 I'm I'm like, I'm safe. Anyway, what it is, it's it's actually actually, uh, folklore. Uh, Wearing green makes you invisible to the leprechauns. Oh, I knew that. Which like to pinch anyone they can see. Yeah, those little assholes. That's why you wear green. So they don't (laughs) pinch you. It's it's actually not the reason. There's like a lot more reasons. And And I was just, that was what I, when I made up. Um, Now I didn't make up. Maybe that's why Ghost Buddy doesn't pinch us anymore because we sleep in green. Uh, Yeah. Sheets. (laughs) No, well, we don't sleep in green sheets. I'm just making uh, that We sure. do every night in green <laughs> sheets. Yeah, and that's what we do. Because Rachel said, let's it's sleep in green sheets. So because I don't want to get pinched by a leprechaun. <laughs> I was just saying, Ghost Buddy doesn't b- bother us, baby, because he's the leprechaun. Yeah. I don't know. I know, right? So we banished him. So here's the thing. Rachel, this morning, <laughs> we I, were talking about something. I don't remember what it was. And I, and I said, uh, well, they're looking long in the tooth. And I'm not... I'm not sure. Long that, in the tooth. Did yeah. you say that? I'm like, what are you talking about? Yeah. What does that mean, long in the tooth? Yeah. Um, I, I got a couple. I, did I put them on here? Let me see if I did. I'm not sure. I don't sure. remember what the um, context of the conversation was, but I gathered it meant someone was old. Yeah. Well, I mean, that came or from. Or hungry. Uh, I don't know. Th- these are common sayings uh, and what it means, but basically, that came from. That's what we were talking about, the old time sayings. Yeah. That kids that, today don't know about. That mm. came from, um, I didn't know the, that. A fa- and this is true, Okay, what? that horses' teeth grow as they age, and then people used to look 
oh. in the horse's mouth if they were buying a horse to see oh. how old the horse was because sense. the longer the teeth were, the older the horse was. Okay, what about yeah. donkeys? Because they have big old teeth and they're all hee haw uh, and they're like big. <laughs> Are they all old? Is a donkey an old horse? I don't know. Is maybe really uh, the bigger the donkey's teeth, maybe, maybe they had a measuring tape out there going, hey, this I'm just wondering if it applies because huge. every donkey I've ever seen yeah. has the longest ass <laughs> teeth. But I've never checked a horse's teeth. All right. So do you know what cat got your tongue means? You yeah. swallowed. You <laughs> said something. The cat ripped it off. No. Uh, someone it. said something that and it remains silent and, and, and when they're expected to speak. Because cats like to what, get what anything that wiggles. Uh, cat got your tongue? That means you um, can't talk. I guess. Well, there's two stories oh. to how this saying came into being. The first one says that it could have come from a, a whip called cat of nine tails oh. that was used by the English Navy for flogging and often left the victim speechless. I'm I mean, sure. Is that like whipping? I'm sure. Ripped people their, were whipping people. What were they whipping, whip, whipping them in the mouth? I mean, come on. No, maybe they, they hit them, them so much yeah. in the back that they were just speechless because it hurt. They were dead. And they were dead. Um, the second, uh, maybe okay. from ancient Egypt, uh, where liars' tongues were cut out as punishment and then fed to cats. Ooh. Oh, I bet that because Egyptians a dark one. worshipped wow. cats. Wow, that's a dark one. I yes. vote for that. I yeah. bet there's some kind of uh, something to that. They th- love the cats. I think so. I think you're right on that they one. They love the cats. Yeah. But would they really feed them someone's tongue? <laughs> I don't know. Would Lucy eat a I tongue? Know. Let me try. Let me I don't pull know. off a little piece. Do you have any? Uh, do you have any no. closing thoughts before the show is done today? Um, I'm just having a good time sitting here at the bar. Okay. Um, it's almost St. Patrick's Day. I would love to go back to the Dubliner. However, I'm not because oh, not this weekend. It's Heck that weekend. No. Um, Everybody in the world's going to be there. The funny thing is, is my parents had a rental property mm-hmm. years ago. This goes back like 20, oh, whatever. But the Dubliner is close by to us, and um, my parents lived. They backed up against like them, uh-huh. and um, every year back in the day, the vomiting. so crowded and so loud and so ridiculous. Vomiting behind their property. Yeah. Oh, it was, cra- it was crazy. Yeah, they it was always crazy. left for that time. So I don't want any part of that, I said. No, I, so, don't, I, don't, yeah. I don't need that. And it's on Sunday night, so that means half the people... It doesn't that, matter. The people that yeah. come out for St. Patty's Day, they'll probably take Monday off if they want to party all night. I guess. It's I like mean, Super Bowl. People take off yeah. Monday because they party all day with the Super the Stuper Bowl. Yeah. So, so, I mean, no, so anyway... I, I mean, don't have any closing thoughts except for that. Well, I mean, I hope that everybody enjoyed the... The new show. It's different. Uh, we, this is our, uh, you know, this is our first episode of it. So we don't exactly have we're it down pat yet. We're just trying to revamp yet. a little and bit and change some things up, zhuzh it up a bit. So um, like Mad Libs is gone unless you guys put down in the comments that you want it back. Then maybe we'll think about it. Yeah. But I need to put the Amazon like bug zappers in the, in the, in the uh, thing down below so you guys can do that. But introducing... I will find that. Yeah. Remind me when we're done with the show. I'll okay. find that and get the link so we can put it down. And we're introducing new video segments into mm-hmm. the show. So so you guys that are, are listening to this on uh, the... Spotify or wherever you yeah. get your um, you, you can podcast actually, from. Like I said, go to Happy Hours with Mark and Rachel on mm-hmm. YouTube and you can we watch the video. We got rid of the K-Beer thing. Yeah. That was just not... That was something we did back in the day. That was us back then. But it wasn't the way things we are now. We tried to... So, yes. We Since tried to we upgrade. started this podcast, yep. it's been upgrade. almost a year and a half. Can yes. you believe we've been doing this for a year and a half? Uh-huh. Um, yeah, we thought we'd just get the K out of things. See, Mark got the K <laughs> the out. The K's off the beer. And, um, and we Back honestly, there. there you go. Listen, listen, I'm being listen, honest with listen. you, Lit and Linda. Yeah. It's happy hours with a S, yep. hours, because we do a lot of different things, and it's Our always channel. happy, and we have lots of yeah. hours of being happy. That's See, a, I'm smiling. That's a good idea, because here we go. Yeah. Let's bring that up. Uh, the thing that, yeah. we, the reason we named it happy hours with instead Mark of, and, and, and someone's going, well, did you just misspell? No, we didn't. Oh. Happy hours with Mark and Rachel because we have so many different things that you can watch on our and YouTube channel. Yeah. So, so it'll be more of a production company and, and kind of name. Yeah, it's a production thing. Yeah. So you'll see that in the video title. And, mm-hmm. and and you guys that are listening won't see that yeah. in the video title, obviously. But there Whatever. You go. It yeah. doesn't take away from the fact that we have lots of playlists and it's all Mark and Rachel. So yeah. just enjoy and peruse them. We would appreciate any thumbs up and likes and comments and subscriptions. We just would love you. Yes, and so with that, we say adieu, farewell, (laughs) until next Friday.
Do you have do, 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 okay, we got it. <laughs> <laughs> well, enjoy your happy uh, St. Patty's Day. Go have, have your green beer. Green beer. Yeah, it's Scottish. It's crap. It's I mean, crap, it's Irish. I said. It's, it's crap. not Scottish. That was Mike Myers. I'm sorry. They're not like. Bye, everybody. Good night. <laughs>